diplomats arrived in Vienna for the first joint talks among the remaining signatories of the Iran nuclear deal since U.S. President Donald Trump's decision to pull out American support. Chinese Foreign Minister Wang Yi said preserving the deal is critical and that China, Britain, France, Germany and Russia would send a, quote, united, determined and strong signal that they remain committed to upholding the accord. But Tehran has been talking tough, warning that it could reduce its cooperation with the UN nuclear watchdog and saying that it will stand firm against US threats to impose fresh sanctions on Iranian oil sales. Diplomats have warned that they have limited scope for meeting Iran's demands. Speaking to French radio ahead of Friday's talks, French Foreign Minister Jean-Yves Le Drian said it would be hard to prepare a sanction-proof economic package to satisfy Iran before the first round of fresh U.S. sanctions kicks in. The sanctions are set to begin in early August with a second wave in November, which we will do our best to prevent. At the end of the talks, European Union foreign policy chief Federica Mogherini, who chaired the meeting, read a statement reaffirming the commitment of all parties to uphold the nuclear deal, but not adding anything new. So talks end with no breakthrough, just a promise of further talks and really no guarantee that the Iran nuclear deal will survive. Kate Parkinson, CGTN, Vienna.